Hello there, everybody in YouTube. Yeah, this is a shitty phone camera video. Um, I didn't want to whip out my normal camera for this because I just wanted to show something here. I'm playing the game Terra, and um, I, I was confused about what to do with performance. Well, well I, I was trying to save temperature. That's what I was trying to do here. And I noticed something. Um, right now I'm running, here, let me show you the game options. Running the game, basically preset six. No change from preset six at all. And, um, um, let me do this real quick off camera. Okay, so, with my computer set up perfectly in our guild Sky Castle, you can see that's my frame rate I'm getting here. And, I stumbled upon this just by mistake, because I wanted to see if temperature would, would change. So there's this program called Park Control, which comes bundled with uh, Process Lasso. And frequency scaling, that's fine to have on. That is perfectly fine. You can see, frame rate, unaffected. But here, and I've seen people say, oh, it's fixed. You have a new processor. You have, you know, you don't have Windows 7 anymore. I have Windows 10. But look, I'll enable core parking just to the, the default value here. And you saw my frame rate before. I didn't change anything else. Now, I don't know if that's the default that Windows does. I don't. I would like to think for some weird reason that the default could be something as drastic as park all the cores. I don't know. But your computer could have all the cores parked, I guess. And I didn't I didn't move the camera or anything in game. You know, way less frames per second here. So now let's go back to that, and uh, I'll disable the core parking, click apply. Look, it's friggin' magic. And the program I'm using is Process Lasso. It's made by bit some. It's got a free trial, which I am still using. Download it, install it, and options, tools, configure CPU core parking, disabled, disabled on core parking. And that's all you got to do. Free performance. Don't mess around with any other utilities. Use that. Because I will reference it in other videos I'm going to be doing. Thanks for watching.